I'm Cal Kellogg, and this is the beautiful Truckee River. We're doing something a little bit different on the channel today. We are fly fishing for winter browns and winter rainbows here on the Truckee River and on the Little Truckee River. This is actually day two of our trip. We've had rain, we've had snow, we've had wind, and we have tangled with some absolutely epic trout with my buddies Abdul, Fabiano, and Scott, and we've hooked up with some top-notch guides, Dan and Matt, and uh, boy, have they ever put us on some awesome, awesome fish. Kick back, enjoy this footage, and if you like it, you're not already a subscriber, please take a second to hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification, and you'll always know when we're here on the FHS Fishing Channel, bringing you the best in trout fishing. So even though below us doesn't really look like you know the perfect trout run, there's a bunch of fish in here right now with these flows, which is kind of perfect. But um, yeah, we have two kind of three depressions right behind you guys in these faster buckets. And then there's fish all through this flat. And then there's some fish over here too, um, but everything above us through that straightaway is all spawning fish. So we're gonna avoid that. So if you notice, um, like right here, it goes from three inches deep to like five feet deep. So that's a good sign guys, we haven't even started yet. It just slid out. Come back, Doug. Nobody likes to show off, Scott. Stick <laughs> <laughs> with me, boys. Rainbow. This has been our, our hot fly recently. That's what we're most of our fish on. Pheasant tail, though, they're eating it at the slap bait. So all of mayfly. You can the line under one or two fingers with a small loop hanging here, at least a couple feet. The flies are dangling below me. I'm going to point at them. You know? <laughs> if you notice, my flies are still in the water. I tilt the rod off my downstream shoulder, and now my thumbnail and my reel are going to face my target, and I'm just going to lob it. And there's the cast. Yeah. Fish on right there. Bam. I like to look through the guy with the net. I'm going to step on the line. Just do your release. You ready, buddy? 
There we go. Alright. Super cool. Yeah, that, I think it is. It's very yellowish, but our rainbows can be kind of yellowish in here, which can be misleading. It, it looks like the biggest fish of the day so far. So, he was on the worm. The worm came loose, and then the second fly caught like a fin or something. Wow, that's a dandy fish. He's big. Folks, the guys are still fishing and they're still catching fish. Um, but we're getting towards the end of day one here on the Little Truckee. This entire Truckee region, well, the entire Sierra, it, it's just great trout fishing country, but uh, the Truckee area in particular, whether you want to fish rivers, streams, small creeks, lakes, um, it's just absolutely phenomenal fishing. Access is great. Fisheries up here are pretty much year round. But uh, if you want to troll, you know, lakes for Mackinac, rainbows, uh, cutthroats, browns, kokanee salmon, you're going to find all that action here. And if you want to stream fish, you want to get out, you want to toss flies, uh, you want to get in on some great catch and release action, you know, you got the main truckee, um, the little truckee, and a whole bunch of other smaller streams. It's just a phenomenal area to visit. If you're an angler, the truckee area is somewhere you don't want to miss. That's for darn sure. That was a nice fish. Yeah, well, Dang, nabbit. Oh. So you can't pull him back up to that heavy water. You need to kind of let him go. It's kind of hard to do. Yeah. That's an adult fish. That's an adult. Fish. 